Hello good people, Mr. Passion here and welcome to another High Tail in Minecraft video. For all my new subscribers, this is a series where I recreate structures from the upcoming High Tail, a game developed by Hypixel Studios. Yes, it's the same one that, is, that runs the Hypixel server, the same guys. Today we are building a ruined military outpost from Zone 2, also known as the Howling Sands. These were human structures that are now abandoned and overrun by undead skeletons from the humans that occupied these places before. That being said, I hope you are able to watch till the end as it helps to tell YouTube that these videos are watchable. And don't forget to like so that YouTube recommends this video to more people. I'll see you after uh, the cinematic that comes after this time lapse. But as for now, enjoy the time lapse and enjoy the cinematic. Well, okay, folks. I hope you I enjoyed that cinematic. I had a lot of a lot of fun putting that on together, and I hope you guys really did enjoy it as much as I did. But right in front of me is the abandoned military outpost, or the ruined military outpost. This is a human structure, like I said earlier, that was that belonged to obese officers uh, like Kairos and Tessa. For those of you that are not familiar with the, uh, with the, with the names I'm talking about, I guess I'll have to leave. A couple links down below to get you familiar with that. Actually, here's an iCard to the Hytale trailer. Well, be this being a human settlement, I decided to make uh, the building out of stone. As you can see in the concept art here, it can be either out of stone or if there's a material change, maybe it could be out of sandstone. But I decided to use stone because it was a better contrast against the, the, the cream of uh, the desert coming in here well there's nothing much we know there's a symbol of Gaia which those five trapdoors are supposed to represent at the entrance and then there are these two banners and uh, coming in here we just have uh, a basic interest right right now a lot of sand has entered into the build and there's a lot of cracks because it has been ruined not occupied you know maybe there was a war that took place here and that's why we have all this so the floors are broken up and it's really non-functional. Right here in the courtyard is where most of the fun happens. Uh, as you can see, there is a military bar barracks in the courtyard um, right here. And this is what this is. There were beds for the soldiers, many of them falling in. Different armor stands where they kept their armor. And maybe uh, these target blocks are to represent the places they used to do uh, um, archery practice from. And next to it is a well. Definitely one of the other structures that you can see indicated here. Uh, of course, the place to draw water. Then next to it is a coop. Uh, I think where the, the chef or the, the cook of the outpost used to keep the food that he cooks for the soldiers that would uh, hang out here. Then next to it is a stand. Probably a place for a merchant to come and sell stuff to the soldiers and whoever is coming into the outpost. I imagine the outpost is a very, very public place because it's an outpost. Many travelers would be coming here. And of course, next to it is a stable, uh, according to the concept art. And of course, the travelers that come in here would have to leave their horses here. And also, not forgetting the horses that belonged to the obese officers that lived in this place. And moving on from that, let's go to the top uh, or, or the next floor, uh, which is really not, not much. It's just a. I didn't do much here. It is just a ruined place with a lot of, uh, you know, holes in the floor and. Uh, Basically, you may need some parkour to get through to the, <laughs> through these. Most of these ruined buildings, you'll definitely need parkour. 
you know we see some plants have overgrown some desert plants and uh, at the end of this is the captain's room i feel it will be a special room i do not know if it's going to really be there but i would imagine that's what you would put in a structure like this one a captain's room whereby we'll probably find some of the best loot that we, that would be in the game and maybe some maps that would lead us to cool treasure coming up here of course this is the overlook that uh, is of the of the structure maybe where the soldiers will be standing you know to shoot at whoever is coming at them but besides that uh we see that uh in the screenshot there will be a people here and probably these will be skeletons because it is now overrun and probably uh long range skeletons that are using spears or bows and arrows so you will need to enter the building very fast to defeat those guys they can hit you from both inside the courtyard and from outside the last main thing is the dungeon tower that is indicated here basically one that would count to uh, the objectives as when you come to this place we have seen that uh, in previous screenshots once you enter some places there will be an objective like kill two trucks and maybe here we're told to kill like 30 uh, 30 soldiers you know 30 skeleton soldiers and at the top here at the top floor maybe we'll find the, an advanced skeletal warrior that we'll have to defeat and get maybe the loot that is hidden at the top but i guess that is a quick overview of the structure it will probably be one to look out for once the game is out it will be much fun as uh, tour in this place you know and fighting all the skeletons that will be around of course i have to tell you the normal youtube thing do not forget to like and subscribe you know you know uh, leave a comment down below tell me what you liked about the build tell me what you hated about the build if you have any recommendations please let me know i'll be, I'll be very glad to uh hear you out but um i guess that is going to be the wrap for this video oh by the way if you have made it this far thank you for watching till the end um thank you so much i cannot tell you how much i appreciate it and uh i recently passed 1000 subscribers <laughs> Uh, that is crazy i'm now at 3970 which is also crazy because i passed it and they really blew out it blew me out of the water now I'm, I'm so happy for everyone that has subscribed i'm so glad for all of you and i hope you guys find a home here all right i guess that's enough for me talking bye <laughs> bye I, if i don't stop now i won't stop bye